Lancaster Morecambe Model Engineers runs its signalling system on an air and solenoid system, the air being 100 psi and the solenoids working at 24 volts. In the signal box frame there are four different colour levers, red, black, green and white. Red being signals, black being points, green being the lights and bells for the level crossing and white being spare. When all the levers are in the forward position they are set for the main line but it's only when the lever is pulled back it is set for a siding or a station. The loco in the station is waiting for the points and signals to be changed. I've just done that now with point 2221 and signal 2B being pulled off now. As soon as that's done the guard can blow his whistle and the train can depart. Now the guard has blown his whistle, the train can depart. The signal I've just pulled off is 6A, that's just round the corner. Once the train has left the station, the points and signals can be changed back to the main line. First the signal, 2B. Then the point 2221. Once the engine has passed 6A, that can also be cancelled. There are two automatic signals on Lancaster Morecambe Model Engineers line, one on the inner line, one on the outer line. The inner line one controls the banking down towards the level crossing. As the train passes the signal, it automatically returns to red. When the train approaches the level crossing at the bottom end of the bank, the signal will go back to green. The next signal we approach is the outer home signal. This is a caution signal ready for the crossing. If the next signal is at danger, you must stop. Uh, the next lever I'm pulling here is the bells for the crossing. And I've just pulled off signal 1A and 2A for going through the station. And 6A has just been pulled. We've cancelled the signals and cancel the bells for the crossing. Now we're cancelling 1A. Two 2A. And when we go around this corner, we will cancel 6A. Six A cancelled. Approaching the ground signal again, which is an automatic signal. This is exactly the same as last time round, so I do not need to explain again.
you can see the automatic ground signal in the right hand bottom corner of this picture. See, go back to green as the local reaches a signal on its left hand side. The train has had to pull up at the point because there is a train already in the station. That train is now departed. I've changed the points to allow the train into the station and release the signal. There we go, we're setting off. As the train pulls into the station, it will stop at the signal at the end of the station. That is the running circuit of the Lancaster Morecambe Model Engineers train and signaling system. Thank you for watching.